Well, first you have to turn on your phone. Why is your screen so dark? Oh, yes. Oh, I guess it is the brightest. Bluetooth page, you go to your settings. You can go down at the bottom mm -hmm. where it says connected devices. Open that. Oops. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll stay on that page. We gotta turn the car on. Oh. Must be activated via cell phone. Okay, so we press this phone instead. Oh, yeah. So Bluetooth must be activated on the cell phone. So what we're gonna do right now is just hit pair a new device at the top. Okay, let's see here. Oh, is this yours? Oh, there it is. So this is the name of your phone. That's oh, yeah. the name of your phone. So I'm going to select it here. Mm -hmm. So it's connecting. So then your phone's going to ask this question. That's the same code that's on the phone. So you can hit pair. And then we'll wait because your phone might ask another question. We'll keep looking at the car, see what it asks. Connected. Audio effects isn't, oh, we don't need that. You can allow for messages like text messages to come through here. Allow. Yeah. And then we'll wait. It's transferring the phone book. So anytime you get in the car, it'll just it, sh it should just sync as long as you have your Bluetooth on. So that's the name of this car, PCM. Oh, I don't know what that means, Porsche or something. Yeah. So here we'll check to see your phone book, see if it's there. So yep. So all you'll have to do when you want to call somebody, just press on it and just press the middle one. I just did. that. Okay, so you can go to pre go to phone book or previous calls. I would think it would have voice command though. 